Hey guys, this is Alpha Person MC, and today I've got for you model one of a very tall door array. So um, this is a door I built using the download link in the description, which I will explain how to use later on. Um, so anyway, this is how it opens, and it takes a while to open actually, and then this is how it closes. But I did actually work on the animation, that's why it's, that's why it's like that. Uh, I just kept it like that because I like it. So, um, I really don't know why a person would need a door that's this big just to go downstairs. Like, um, if you open the door, there's only one way and it's down or up if you're in creative mode. But, uh, yeah. So, uh, one use of this door which I thought of is just to use like a, like a sort of meter, I guess. Uh, I'm using red wool here. Uh, I guess it looks kind of cool. But, yeah. So, um... The description has a download in it, and in that download is a folder, and it is compressed. So, if your computer doesn't handle zip files, uh, oh well. Huh. So, um, there are these three files here, and there are um, schematic files. When you open them in MC Edit, you'll get them just like this, and um, you'll have to stack one on top of the other one. So, you'll have to uncheck the box where it says copy error, otherwise things just won't work out right. Just, just like doesn't work at all. So uh, these two blocks down here will not be there. I just use them to create the schematic and uh, same thing with these. So this is the top, the middle, and the bottom which you can probably see. The smallest door which you can make using these three parts is 12 blocks tall which is actually twice the size of the Temple of Notch door. Uh, the Temple of Notch video is in the description below. The link to it at least. So yeah. Um, the door can be as tall as you want as long as your computer can handle it and the chunks don't really lag out all the way up there. So yeah, that's actually pretty much it. Thanks for watching.